Alrighty, so today is Tuesday. So today I'm going to talk about a funny moment in my life. And then Wednesday is going to be today's vlog. Alright? <laughs> I have a funny moment that happened in my life. Instead of it being in high school, it happened in middle school. So this is what happened. Our whole entire school, <clears throat> our whole entire school went to the gymnasium and we had like a panther day or something like that, that we, had, we get to spend the last few hours of school watching a basketball game, having fun and all that. I was sitting in the bleachers and I got up and I had my S3 camera. I really hate that phone. Anyways, the day before I got a brand new case that you were able to put it on your belt and slide the phone in and you didn't have to keep it in your pocket. And my mom said if you drop it, it's going to be broken and I'm not going to get you a new phone. You'll stick with the other phone you have. And I can see that because the phones we got were brand new and they're really expensive. I don't know if it was a Viar City, I said that wrong, but I don't know if it was that, if it was one-on-one, -on -one, girls versus boys, girls versus girls with the same team split in half and all that. I was panning around to see everybody's reaction, and I fell on top of people. Just here's the clip so you'll see what happened. That happened. So I showed my mom and my dad and my sisters and they started laughing their butt off because it's so funny. I explained to them how I fell so gracefully that <laughs> I fell so gracefully that I was actually trying to grab on to people. And that's like an instinct, right? Like you have to do that because like your mind is panicking. You don't want to hit your head or, or anything. But I was falling on backpacks. I was falling on people. Not literally falling on people. Maybe I was. But I was falling. And it was so graceful because I remember how slow it was. The thing was is that I was turning like this. Going to the front and then going to the side here. And I think I lost my balance because I was... It's such a small space between the chair and where you walk. So I was trying to twist and I lost my balance and I fell onto these people and I was grabbing on things. And you can hear I hit the ground with my hand or something I hit. And I didn't fall hard. I didn't have any bruises. I didn't have any type of issue it was really funny and let's let's show you the clip one more time <laughs> i was i posted it on social media and uh, that was probably one of the most funniest things i ever caught on film Set aside from something else that I completely lost and I was really upset about. Still am. So catch me next week when I talk about me falling on something else. So today, um, Tuesday, people and all my friends went back to school. And here's the thing, Monday, because of the ice and the weather, they canceled school. And the ice didn't thaw until like 12 o'clock. So I can see that, so they're in school right now. So it's weird not going to school because a lot of people think I'm crazy 
but I actually enjoy school a lot. I like my mind being occupied with things, so it's just hard trying to keep my mind occupied and running and doing things. Also, this, my school is doing Beauty and the Beast, and all my four years of being in high school, I only did the musical three times because my freshman year I couldn't and then my sophomore year we did um, Greece junior year was Oklahoma and my senior year which is technically my final year which they are doing Beauty and the Beast and I wanted to do Beauty and the Beast in replace of Oklahoma but that didn't happen so I mean it's it's a little weird not going to school I do miss it but just the environment of school it's not worth it because usually people act stupid and uh, they just don't act appropriate with the rules at school and in public so see I'm one of those kids that never got into trouble that became friends with teachers and um, out of all of my teachers except one because that teacher left my uh, I wrote a letter to all of my teachers, including my principal, even though he wasn't a teacher. I was going to write to one of my assistant principals, but he left to go to a different school, so bummed out here. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,